While Husker Harvest Days is the Western Corn Belt's largest farm show with more than 600 exhibitors, the three-day event gives producers a look at new equipment and technologies in America's heartland. RFD-TV's Mark Oppold has more from Grand Island, Nebraska. Day one behind us here at Husker Harvest Days. A little windy starting out, a little cloudy weather, but good crowd coming in here today. Travis Krigshauser joining me from Pioneer in Circa Nitrogen Services. How was your first day here? Uh, it was a busy one. We've yeah. got a lot of conversations with growers, which is always exciting. You mentioned something uh, with me earlier today I wanted to share tonight is that, Mark, producers are more empowered, maybe than they realize, with the data they have available. Yeah, I think where we're at today is in terms of being able to take advantage of the investments were made in precision agriculture over the last several years when times were really good and obviously markets and margins are pretty tight right now so growers are looking to be able to make investments and to further their operation really focused in on how do I manage input costs while still improving yield you know increasing yield stability we can do that with decision services so we'll be able to use you know crop models and predictive analytics to be able to use growers data to empower decision zones within circuit we're able to use that information to help make better predictions of the variability in the field and then throughout the season make recommendations to be able to apply to that variability increasing profitability by decreasing you know you know inconsistencies in yield are they buying into that I mean they're, they're watching costs more yep. than ever before and they're saying well Travis this is an investment is it going to be returning on my investment yeah so what we were able to show over 2015 is we had over 128 different growers that implemented their own strip trials using in circa nitrogen management where they basically use their traditional practice maybe shut off the prescription that we created for nitrogen management. We made, the, made those comparisons and what we saw was that on average 74% of the time the INSERCA recommendation was more profitable than their traditional practice. So we were increasing yields by six bushels when we were winning those and we we're using about nine pounds less nitrogen. So it ended up being about $27 gross revenue per acre. So when growers see that I think they have comfort that we know we can manage nitrogen better. How do we do it and have a plan? Every year is going to be different. We can customize solutions. Very good. Thanks Travis. All right. Thank you. All right, just one example here. What's available to producers at Husker Harvest Days? Travis Craigshauser, Pioneer Nitrogen in Circa Nitrogen Services. Mark Oppold, RFD TV News, Husker Harvest Days, Day 1, Grand Island, Nebraska. Well, thanks again, Mark. Now, Husker Harvest Days does continue through Thursday, September 15th in Grand Island. RFD-TV is there providing coverage and updates throughout the week on our Market Day report and, of course, right here on the Rural Evening News. For more information, go online to huskerharvestdays.com.